Hey guys, Ian here with Redline to show you Kernel's SP6 KSS drive-on single post parking lift. This thing is a lot like a four post lift, kind of like what you see right there, only it only has one post. So it really makes a great use of all the extra space in your shop. Today's models are not like the old models in that they only have one brace right here. There's no longer a brace on the inside. So no matter how low your car sits, it's not an issue. So that's a big improvement that they made into the lift one of the things I want to show you is it does have these rails that you see that run down the length of the runway uh, those things are for drip trays plastic drip trays that you can install between the runways and you know put them beneath the transmission or engine or whatever just to make sure you know that you're not sitting there dripping any kind of fluid on something another car down below you do have removable wheel stops right here that keep you from running off of this machine you might notice that the base of this lift is really beefy you've got this great big base and this unit is going to require six inches thick concrete 3000 psi uh, compression strength in order to support this lift so thicker concrete than you know say the four inches required for one of those 9000 pound two post lifts if you don't have concrete that meets that requirement We've got this uh, sheet right here that you can have a look at on our website. I'll put a link in the description where you can download it. And it basically just shows you what is required to tear out of your concrete and to, you know, pour in order to make sure that it's going to be strong enough for this lift. I do want to point out that the ramps on this unit have uh, like a nylon roller that keeps it from tearing up your floor in case you've got a real nice epoxy floor. You may notice in this video that the runways lean backward. That is on purpose so that when you run off and put that you know 4,000 pound car on there it flattens it out so that's done on purpose don't think anything of that uh, having a look at the power unit right here this is a 110 volt power unit so you know you can plug this thing right into a regular wall outlet we can switch you out with a 220 if you request that but it's nice to be able to use this without uh, needing an electrician so here's your safety lock release right here you're just going to pull that while you push down on the release for the power unit to lower it We'll go ahead and have a look at the inside of this unit right here. It is very, very heavy duty and beefy. I don't remember the exact weight offhand, but I think it's somewhere close to 3,000 pounds, maybe 2,600 if I remember correctly. Gotta be anchored to the concrete. Gotta be a lot of concrete, six inches, 3,000 PSI. Just a really, really beefy lift. You can see the construction of this thing very very thick steel and it's got to be considering that nothing is supporting it out over there this is just a complete cantilever lift but uh, does a great job of making use of the space in your shop so that you don't have all of these extra posts you know you don't have a post there and a post there and so forth all the way around this thing so that is your Kernel SP 6k SS drive on single post uh, parking lift i'm going to put a link to it down below in the description where you can see it on our website redlinestands.com subscribe and like the video if uh, you appreciate this kind of content have a good one